What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. So I want to talk about Windows, boot times, and uh, overall computer, you know, performance. So I, I built a computer for myself. You know, it's got a, a Ryzen 9 12 core, 24 thread, like top of the line RAM, RTX 3070. It's got, you know, 10 terabytes and I believe four terabytes of which is the M.2 hard drives directly on the uh, the motherboard so my computer like when it when it was fresh and brand new I mean this thing was fast like screaming fast it was like unbelievable but then obviously over time you know, you're going online, you're downloading stuff, you're doing stuff, and, you know, about, like, three days ago, actually a week ago, I started to notice that my computer was running slow. Like, it was, it was starting to become annoying. You know, I'd be recording a video, and it would be jittery, it would be glitchy, like, video games would be glitchy, and, uh, it would say, oh, your video, uh, settings are too high, and I'm like, what do you mean? I, I haven't changed anything. It's, it's been the same. How are my video settings too high? And then it would boot up Windows and it was taking like a minute plus. A minute plus to boot into Windows. And then a few times you see uh, the little, oh, th these little tray icons down here. It would, Windows would load up and it would be on the desktop, but those little icons, it would take an additional like 30 to 45 seconds for them to pop up. And I know how to go and check, uh, you know, startup. So I, I want to, I, I found a way to make it fast again, and I'm just sharing my experience and what I did. And there's a couple of programs that I highly recommend. Anyone that has Windows, do two programs and you're good to go. Antivirus, anti-spyware, uh, and they're cheap. And they do not slow the computer down. So if you're, if you're having slow Windows, the first thing I would do is click on the search bar that's behind me and type in msconfig. And then you'll get this system configuration and you click on that and then you go to startup and then open task manager and then right here these are all the things you know as you install programs they they kind of put themselves here and it will they'll automatically be enabled so when you start your machine everything loads even if you don't want to use it it just loads so I went through this list and obviously I left things that I was unsure about or I thought that the computer needed like uh, tray application this thing I left Windows security I left but everything else like Steam ICU Google Drive like all this stuff you just you click on it and then you click disable and just disable them all Disable all of it, except for obviously the, the important stuff. And then once you do that, I would download SpyBot, Search and Destroy. And I think it's like 24 bucks or something, or 30 bucks for an entire year. And you get antivirus, spyware, live internet protection, and it's good, it's really good and it does not slow the computer down at all. And that was, I mean, I've been using this for years. And you can get a free version, but you just don't get any virus with the free version. And then I've had CCleaner. I've had CCleaner for years and years and years, but I always had the free version. And I, I used the free version, but you know, it, it, it didn't work that well, I, I guess, because I started searching on the internet, uh, you know, PC, programs to speed up the computer and CCleaner came up and I'm like well I already have that well maybe I need to upgrade so I paid the $24 whatever it was for one year 
and I ran the registry tool. You run it, it comes up with issues, you fix them. You run it again, comes up with issues, you fix them. And you keep doing it until there's none left. Once you do that, you, uh, you can update drivers. So this will scan through your computer. And even if there's stuff you don't know about, it'll find it, update the drivers for you. And then I just ran a uh, PC health check. You know, it went through and checked everything. It was like, oh yeah, you have all of these uh, trackers and this, that, and the other thing. Ran that. And then I went and rebooted my computer. 15 seconds. In 15 seconds. Boom! It was like lightning fast again. I was like, holy shit! Yes! So... If you have slow windows, I would definitely check those three things. Your startup, MS, config. Make sure there's not a bunch of crap loading. And then I would run SpyBot and CCleaner. Those two programs, that's it. That's all you need, you're good. So uh, yeah, hopefully, hopefully this is helpful to somebody. If it is, make sure you... Smash it up and uh, yeah, see you later.